Hey, you know what? I've always thought about trying that Ancestry.com stuff and the DNA stuff and all of that to see where your lineage is and where you come from, all that good stuff. See what family you got, see who you connected to, all of that. I've always thought about doing that, but I've always thought like in the back of my head, like how can they actually distinguish like where your family come from? Like after they find out where that family is, like how can they go and find out where that family comes from and that family and that family because it's it keeps on going on and on and on. Once you get to a certain point, there's a point before then. So how can y'all go all the way back to the back to the back to the back? It's impossible for them to know exactly where you come from and which tribe it actually is or what tribe you actually from. It's impossible, especially when you're talking about actual origin. Yeah, that's what's been in my head, man. And now I see this. Check this out. Hey, it says Ancestry does not break down DNA results by tribe, mm -hmm. but we do provide an approximate geographical region which they identify as the indigenous <laughs> americas okay <laughs> okay cool <laughs> all right so they don't break down tribe right and so you know that might be one that's a really good reason why you know the you know you shouldn't use the dna testing to become a tribal citizen because they, they can't tell you which tribe you came from <laughs> and so there you go right there right and so um that's one thing but my question is okay so geographical region you know and so okay what regions do you test right and and then um which regions do you not test and does that make a difference in you know uh particularly for you know certain um groups of indigenous peoples from the united states what i did do is i have the north american regions okay that they that they test all right well yeah that would make sense for us right? so let's just go with these all right is they they test this as indigenous Haiti and Dominican Republic. Okay. Okay, with the islands. Okay, so they went straight to the islands. They went to the islands. All right, all right. They went to uh, indigenous Puerto Rico. Mm -hmm. All right. Mm -hmm. so it's indigenous Cuba. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then these are the spots in the indigenous Americas, north. Okay. Okay. So now when we start to talk about that. So now, we're talking about North America right now. North America. Okay. So now the, um, so they have the islands. Now they have North America. Okay. And they have in Mexico. Okay. They do the Baja Peninsula and the Southern California coast. Mm -hmm. Okay, so mm -hmm. they get the, uh, the Baja Peninsula from California. Mm -hmm. Then they say Central and Southern Mexico. So within Southern Mexico, they do get Texas in there. Okay, somewhere. In Southern Mexico? In, in, Northern Mexico? Uh, well, Central, Central, uh, Central. Oh, no, you know, with the, those, no, I think, no, those are just all the regions, okay, in, um, in Central and South. Uh, okay, in Central and Southern Mexico. Okay, including yeah. the Yucatan. Okay, yes, including the Yucatan. Okay, so there's nothing there in, in the United States at all. Okay, okay. I noticed that they do uh, 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 Guatemala, no, no, uh, Guantanamo. Southeast Guantanamo. Okay. North, uh, Western Guantanamo. I just found it. <laughs> and they would do Guantanamo. Yes, okay. All right, and then they have the Central Highlands, Northeast Mexico, and Southeast Texas. Okay, so okay. now we're getting into the United States. So now we're getting into the United States. So we where got they California, do, and New Mexico. And, and um, Texas. Texas, Southeast Texas. Okay. Okay. All right. Then they have a section where it says New Mexico and Southern Colorado. Okay. So they do that area over there. Okay. Okay. So we really know that Southern, that West, uh, Southwest, Midwest Plains, yes. right? Yes, Southwest, yeah, Southwest, Southwest Plains. Yes. Okay. okay. They do Northeastern Mexico and South Texas. Okay. So again, so we Texas have Texas, is good. San Antonio, they have their, you know, um, um, that looks like San Antonio, looks like the only place there in, in South Texas that they have listed. Yeah. Okay. And then they have South Texas listed again in the uh, Tamaulipas in South Texas. Mm -hmm. And they have the Rio Grande, you see the Rio Grande Valley okay. in there. Mm -hmm. Okay. I and, see also see uh, Southwest Arizona. Okay. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. So the Mexico and Southwest Arizona. And okay. That's it. That's it. Those, those were all the sections of the United States that they check so hold up so they don't <laughs> because they use the term cherokee we will too they don't they don't touch the cherokee they don't and you know it 23 and me doesn't either and they <laughs> <laughs> got it <laughs> got it <laughs> they don't test any tribe east of the mississippi especially not in the southeast no and so for those individuals that are interested in using the Ancestry.com to see if you have Native American ancestry or not, if you think that you're indigenous to the United States um, on the East Coast, right, east of the Mississippi, 
you can't use any of these tests because they don't test those people. <laughs>